New jeans. Okay, okay, okay. New Attention. Jeans. You gonna go first? Yeah, I'm gonna go first. Um, I like the video, man. I like the video. I like the video for a couple reasons. I think, um, I like it for the simple fact that I, I like how just they they can express themselves by saying they actually want the attention of a uh, just a, a just a male presence kind of like uh-huh. I think that's cool when you know when girls can kind of be vulnerable and say like they want the attention if that's what the the song is trying to portray if I'm if I'm wrong then tell me I'm wrong if not like like please tell me I'm wrong so I mean um also real quick too it feels good to be back be back hey. in the building. Hey. Um, we didn't want to do like a, a whole coming back thing, so we're just gonna hop right into it. You know, um, just trying to get back into swinging things. We miss you guys as usual, guys. You of know, of course, of course, of course. Definitely want to get back in the lab and give you guys content. So we're here now, reacting to this. So, but yeah, um, I like the video, man. I definitely like the beat. I got an old school vibe from the beat. Um, I was gonna say that. I got an old school. We should have went first. I got an old school vibe from the beat, Damn. but um. I definitely vibe with the beat. It's like a part in the beat where the beat kind of had this thing to where it kind of, it went silent and then you can hear it. And, but I just like that when beats can do that. Like, I feel like that separates songs from like other songs. When you get when you get to, to kind of digest the beat as opposed to the beat just keep playing and you just keep, you keep hearing vocals over the beat and then kind of just mesh together. I like when sometimes you, you're quiet and then you can hear the actual beat playing in the background. And sometimes I'm looking forward to that a lot. So... I like this I like this video. Um I definitely like the group. Um this is like I said our first time reacting to them. Um they seem kinda young. I mean I did I was gonna say that they actually do like a, a young group. Like that's not to take anything away from them. It seems like they might be I don't wanna say targeted. It almost seems like this song was targeted too towards like a younger even though it, I'm gonna say this, like we haven't ever done reactions with headphones but i'm gonna say it definitely helps like hearing all the music in your ears directly as opposed to like reacting to it out loud because that's what we normally do we normally have the audio play out loud and we kind of like try to pick up on everything and it's already hard enough trying to pick up on subtitles and what's going on in the video let alone the sound but just to have it in your ears bro it was one part in the song where it was like a I was like, mm-hmm. yeah. I was like, I wanted to know, like, who is that? Like, if that's like somebody in the group, like, particular, like, did they? I mean, it definitely, like, I don't know. It gave me like a, like, Kogan said, like a whole old school vibe. I felt like, you know, just to hear it in the headphones, it kind of like went a little harder than I felt like it would if we didn't hear it in the headphones. But yeah, yeah it, it's almost like listening to, listening to a song on your phone and then listening to it in your car. It's like. You get two different feels from it. Not only that, but you hear more. Like, I just felt like you, I don't know. And that's why we always kind of wanted, this was always something we wanted to add into our reactions, headphones, but we never really took the time out to do it. But now it's like, it's, I feel like it's a big difference, especially when you're trying to listen to people that just, they don't, they sing. So it's like, you can catch, or you just catch certain things within a beat. But I actually liked it, bro. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm, despite whether I think it's, I feel like it might be for a younger audience. It still kind of gave me a whole vibe to where, yeah, you know I mean, like, like it's just an old school vibe. It's like you can uh-huh. just bounce with it. And 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 to to kind of piggyback on the old school vibe, there were a lot of old school like items in the video that I noticed. Me personally, like even when we were doing like, and this is aside from the video, even when we were doing well. When I was looking for headphones to actually use for the set, I typed in retro headphones and the orange headphones she had on, they were like retro. So it's oh, like, for real? yeah, so it's kind of like, it, it had a, ro- a retro vibe. And if you pay attention to the TVs too, they were like box TVs. So it's kind of like- And then she had on, I mean, the outfits, I feel like they kind of, Korean style is just always different in general, but she had on like the jersey, almost like a FUBU jersey, like an old like FUBU or just like, I don't know. And we recently just came from back uh, like a, a 90s party and stuff like that. So it kind of gives that vibe back to kind of see like, it's cool to see that, like to see, you know, K-pop do that and new jeans do that and, like, and the sense to just bring me back like an old school, like. It's like if this came in, and on the playlist it kind of like it was it would you be still like what is that but at the same time it was still kind of like flow with anything that you would listen to but you like, know what you know what's crazy what i just thought about too what? i think it'd be dope if if we just made a playlist or it's just like there was a playlist out there that had k-pop 90s you talking and, about everything that we've heard and i'm not even saying everything that we heard i'm saying like what we haven't heard 
Like, cause even when we did, we did Shiny. Uh huh. One of one. Yeah. One. Uh huh. Well, what's the name? What? Uh. NCT. What was that? Nineties Love. See, that's what I'm saying. Like stuff like that. Like I feel like you can put that. Like it's like kind of like modern. I actually want to test that. We should low key like throw that in like a, you know, have a party to where you throw it and then you throw in like that playlist too. Like you mix it in between and see if people like. It throws people off. Because uh-huh. I know that, of course, the Korean language would throw people off. But at the same time, the whole uh-huh. vibe, I don't, it's not, nah. It's, yeah. I feel like you can still go off. Any any music here can still feel it in their, their rhythm and everything else, the beats and everything else. So, And honestly, I just think it's dope in general just to kind of go back in the 90s, 90s feel of music. Just, you know, because I don't, I don't think we get that a lot, you know. I try to express that to my kids just all genres of music yeah. like I, I try not to be biased towards like any type of music like i'm not a person that's like oh i want to hear the i don't want to hear country i want to hear heavy metal not bias like yeah i want to hear everything bro like and granted i may not like the first couple tracks but gar- guarantee like if i go through the album i might like a few tracks so yeah. i'm never i'm never biased to any music and i want my kids to experience that too so and i only said that because they they had they don't grow up in this era and they won't grow up in that era i was so. just on what's the name too i was on instagram and i was like I think it was a post with like a whole bunch of old like music and i'm just looking at it like damn bro like we you ain't never gonna get that time back but stuff hearing stuff like this kind of gives me like a little slight piece of hope it's like you know you mm. or just the old stuff that we have heard it's like yo you still gonna get people that's gonna kind of like even even in one not well even one of one and uh 90s love the moves uh-huh. like the moves they were doing exactly was still like <laughs> yeah, 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 but even in uh, what's the name? One of one, he was doing a whole bunch of old school movies. What? Uh, yeah, what? yeah, yeah, it definitely went in. Yo, <laughs> somebody has a playlist, bro. Like, like give that to us. Like, I'm not saying give it. Like, just make a playlist so that way we can react to it and see, like, get the '90s feel from each song. Like, and I know y'all know there's songs that are K-pop that are '90s, like that have the '90s vibe that that they made modern but add '90s to it. So it's like. Please, you know, I drop that in the to, comments. I was trying to get some symbolism in here, but I couldn't, like, I don't know. I don't want to say it was any in here. It could have just been a video, but uh-huh. I was trying to pay attention to certain things. Like, the sign on the, what's the name, on the road, like, the highway sign. I think it said, like, Girl Tona or something like that. Uh-huh. I wanted to say it was, like, Daytona, but uh-huh. it said Girl Tona. I don't know if that means anything, but then it <laughs> could just be a place in Korea, you know? <laughs> the one girl fucking, she grabbed, the way she grabbed the cake, you know, like a... NBA young boy fan, she like grabbed it backwards and like ate it. I'm like, why? Why she do that? Like, I don't know. I thought that was weird, but it was funny. But um, what else? It was something else. I can't remember. And just it's a video concept, like guys. If you can kind of lab, you can if huh? Uh huh. You heard what I was No, just if you can kind of elaborate as far as like like I try to grasp the video concept, and I was a little confused in the beginning. Like I. I want to say like she woke up from a woke up from a dream like it was it was a dream but it wasn't a dream because like they they seen the boy at the concert she woke up her mom was calling I don't even know if she necessarily woke up but she just seemed like it just transitioned into a different scene but like, that girl was somewhere she was uh, wasn't supposed to be her mom called and she didn't answer and she there, was looking for attention out there chilling with Brad looking for attention. <laughs> nah, but dope video man. Shout Brad's out to the man. <laughs> Shout out to New Jeans, man. We definitely gonna have to check out more from them, bro. But I think De- it's gonna wrap it up for definitely, us. Definitely, 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 guys. We 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 are glad to be. Back. I can't even talk. We're glad to be back. Sorry we didn't do like a big coming back thing. We dropped something in the community, but we're definitely glad to be back. We definitely miss you guys with all our hearts, and we appreciate all of your comments, all your we miss you comments and stuff like that. We see them, we acknowledge them in our heads, and we definitely will try to get back to you guys as soon as possible and show our love. But Without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get on out of here. As usual, guys, once again, my name is Kogan. It's your boy, Kate. And that's Skull Pack Reacts.